When James succeeded Elizabeth, he was already the King of Scotland, thus uniting Scotland and England under a common rule. He styled himself as the King of Great Britain. He wanted to rule a united kingdom instead of being the King of England, Scotland, and Ireland separately. Unlike his predecessor, he advocated royal absolutism and didn't want Parliament to be able to meddle in his affairs. To be clear, the Parliament at this time was far from democratic and instead was made up of unelected nobles. But James felt that being king was a divine right and that since God appointed the rightful king, his power should be unchecked. His conflicts with his government came to a head when he dissolved Parliament in 1611. During James's rule, the English began colonizing America, naming their first permanent settlement Jamestown in his honor. James I met several people from the Powhatan tribe during his reign, including the famous Pocahontas.